So COVID cases are on the rise. The city of Houston has seen the virus in the wastewater go up. The positivity rate is going up, and that means that the virus is spreading. But there's one key indicator that it's not as alarming this time around. There are currently more than 17,000 COVID cases in Houston and in Harris County. The city's chief medical officer, Dr. David Purse, met with me today to discuss the rise in cases, but says people are not getting as much severe illness from the disease right now. What we're not seeing is a big increase in the number of people requiring hospitalization, or at least not yet. So that's good news. There are 371 people hospitalized with COVID across 25 counties in southeast Texas, plus 34 children. And the other thing to keep in mind is that a lot of the people that are in that statistic are people who are being admitted to the hospital for something else, but they happen to test positive for COVID. But when I talk to my colleagues who are working in emergency departments, yes, they have again started admitting people because of COVID complications, which we hadn't seen for several weeks, maybe even a month or so. We just hope that again, that those people who are most vulnerable are the ones that are doing the best job of protecting themselves so they don't wind up in the hospital. And to do that, it is recommended that you get the COVID vaccine and booster. Dr. Purse said that the booster is key to defending against Omicron. And children under five, the last group eligible for a vaccine, may have an approved vaccine later this month. The FDA is scheduled to review Moderna's application for emergency use on June 15th.